Veux-tu te sortir des lumières pour, euh, pour, pour la vidéo? Ah, ben si tu veux, mon ami, si tu veux. Oh, by the way, mon nom, c'est Elton, comme Elton John. <laughs> Salut, Pierre. Now, this is incredible to see this. I've never seen one of these. This is one of those cars you only see in a book. Quand t'es prêt? Look at that, it's got dual headlights even. Wow! Hey, je m'attendais pas à ça. J'aurais pensé deux gros headlights, that's it. Let's see. Ça, c'est-tu en métal, ça? Non, c'est tout du rubber. Ça, c'est tout du gros rubber. Ah oui, c'est rubber. Wow! Wow, that is something. J'ai essayé de trouver les bumpers européens pour, mais ils sont... Euh, mais ils en ont fait combien d'à peu près? Euh, ils en ont fait ça juste quelques années, je pense. Ça, ils en ont fait de 81 à 86. They made Bien. these from 81 to 86. Ils en ont juste fait 461. That's it. They only made 471. 61. 461. And what's the mileage? Uh, 80, I just turned 84,000 miles on it. 84,000 miles. And he found this car in North Carolina. And he said he was looking for this car for three years, man. And here we're in the land of muscle cars and Mustangs and Camaros and Firebirds and Trans Ams and Mustangs. And, and to see this is a total shock, man. It's amazing. To see this here, to me, is as amazing as seeing that... Uh, That green step van I filmed over there earlier, that's not common either. Uh, moi j'aime toutes sortes de voitures anciennes. type Jag over there that I saw while driving in. Yeah, but even E-type Jags are common compared to this, you know? And it's an inline six now, pas de combien pouces cube à peu près. Look at the, uh, they did that BMW style of like middle type of uh, exhaust tips. Wow, that's neat. Wow, and what's the horsepower, like uh, 200 something? 210, 235 uh, uh, pound-feet of torque. Sunroof. Hey, Pierre, merci d'avoir amené ça, man. C'est vraiment... Tu vois, c'est pour ça que je viens à ce show-là. C'est parce que moi, je suis mis up, you know? Fait que je prends le métro directement de Montréal. Ça me débarque à un moment ainsi, je marche 10 minutes, and I'm here. Parce que je suis mis up, je peux pas conduire légalement. But I'm almost an expert in classic cars. I've sacrificed my life to these earth-killing machines. <laughs> Look at the interior. It's sexy and, and, and sumptuous and luxurious and... Look at that, those seats, they look so comfortable. And you know, I thought this was a British car. And it's German. It's German. But it's an Italian, it's, the interior is Italian. Yeah, I think you're right. The, it's got... It's made by, the interior was made by a company called Salt. The same people who did the, uh, the Maseratis wow. in the 80s. I like those, those floor mats too, eh? My goodness, I want to yeah, get a, let me get a shot of the, I bet you they are. I, I looked at that, I said, whoa, man. You know what the front looks like too? It looks like a, the front of a Triumph TR7, TR8, eh? Hidden headlights, yeah, but bigger, you know, wider. Man, that's really, well, you know what? And now I got the right sun here. Let me get a nice shot here. Oh, uh, yeah. Uh, can I get my, not get my shadow in the way here? Uh, well, you know, we do what we can. Ah. The grill and all that and the bumper definitely has a Ferrari kind of a look to it, eh? Mais comment que t'as tombé en amour avec cette marque de voiture qui est tellement euh, différente, tellement bizarre? Moi j'aime les autos weird. Obviously, obviously. Moi j'aime les autos que je suis sûr de pas en croiser un autre des classes de même. Dans les rues du Rhône, mais ça, ça va pas trop. Ok. Mais ça, c'est absurde au Québec. Yeah, I wouldn't... Je pense que je te demandais ça aussi, Pierre, parce que je, 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 je pense que j'ai jamais vu un moteur 6 d'Opel, tu sais, parce que, comme tu le sais, c'est pas des, des, des moteurs qui, ont été, euh, qui sont rendus ici. Look at that, that's beautiful. That's a big motor, man. Ça dérangerait-tu de start? Oh, that would be great. Now you get to see and hear a motor that we, that nobody has ever really seen here in North America. It's a 3.9 liter, and the gentleman said when he was looking for this car, he wanted one that was manual, not automatic. Yeah, man. Hey, je vais juste prendre le son de l'exhaust en arrière. Yeah, sounds good, man. Sounds healthy. Yeah, man. 200, uh, what do you say? 210 to 230 horsepower. Hey, merci, Pierre. You know, you're number one, my friend. <laughs>